I did a lot of research first on like harvesting organs and everything that's happening. And then I had to like create a backstory for this character to understand how there is no no awareness at all whatsoever about the consequences of her actions. How there's like so much lack of humanity with these people, right? That they like completely disassociate and detach mm -hmm. from what's actually happening. So basically, it was a lot of research and also trying to understand what is her need, like what is going on with them as a couple as well, that they're in this together, doing basically this horrible thing. So it's kind of like finding the humanity in them and understanding what their driving force is. I got into also doing research on different cartels and the crime uh, organizations that are like all the way down in Colombia and, and Mexico, El Salvador. And I just started reading articles about the kids that get trafficked, uh, the kidnappings. And and I just kind of got into that mindset of, you know, he's, he's somebody that's shady, you know? So, you know, just kind of just started infusing that material that I was reading and researching and, and then just kind of putting it into perspective of like who this guy is and, and bringing him to life. To be able to like, get out of your comfort zone because it's it's a lot easier to play someone that's like a beautiful human being and like all of this stuff but to be able to like get inside the mind of someone that might be doing questionable things and find that in yourself it's such a cool process for me i really enjoy like exploring this character sometimes you gotta take a time to kind of think of that mindset for those shady characters, those individuals that are doing things in darkness. You gotta kind of tap into what is it that's making their brain tick the way it is. I'm pretty sure that at one point in their life, maybe they were good people, good human beings, but certain circumstances led them to go down that dark path, especially like maybe when they don't have any other options.